afternoon all of you welcome to the career counseling class so we have started this course because uh, there are so many career options nowadays and you may be confused with which career options to choose and what are some career options so that's why we have uh, Decided that we will discuss one one career option one day. We have discussed career with graphic design, career with art, careers with public speaking. These are not very usual career options. If you want to go for some like um, different career options like public speaking, uh, art, graphic designing, these are a little bit different. From the general career options, like if you are not going to the government jobs like civil service, IPS, IAS, or any other options like police, so you you want to work in like private organization or you want to work on your own, so you can choose this option. Today we will discuss about digital marketing. So digital marketing is getting popular day by day. If you see some graph in internet, you can see like how it has increased yearly and how it is like uh, today what uh, what is the height and what is the demand of digital marketing. So we will discuss everything. So let's start. I think it will be interesting. Okay, so if you have been looking to start your career in digital marketing in India or anywhere around the world, we understand it could get a bit overwhelming in the beginning. So, but with the right and clear information regarding the career opportunities in the digital marketing in India, you will be able to understand the options that are available and choose the right one. So if you have the right and clear information about digital marketing in India, you will understand the options which are available and how you have to choose the right option. So in this blog, it's not a blog, so we will equip you with all necessary information you need to start your career in a in digital marketing. So you make sure to the end of the blog for some tips on how you can start a successful career in digital marketing. So before we get started, let's shed some light on why digital marketing is gaining so much popularity and what is the career growth of digital marketing in India. So for all the unversed, digital marketing is the marketing of your products, services through digital channels and mediums and making them visible to the viewers and turn them into customers and retain them. Now let's see why digital marketing is so important in today's time. So why digital marketing is important? Scope and need of digital marketing in India. The scope of digital marketing in India picked up right from its introduction because of its ability to market products and services to a larger global audience at affordable rates. So the scope of digital marketing in India has picked up right from its introduction. Why? I already told you that if you see the graph, it has increased a lot because of its ability to market products and services to a larger global audience at affordable rates. The choice of advertising your products online to only those who fit your target audience criteria or remarketing your ads specifically to people who showed interest in the past was one of the many reasons why marketers shifted to digital marketing. 
the choice of advertising your products online to only those who fit your target audience criteria So this was the only reason why marketers shifted to digital marketing because you can uh, like target the um, audience like to whom you are going to marketing your product. And to top that off, since the COVID-19 crisis, digital marketing was being adopted by companies small or large because it proved to be one of the most effective ways to conduct marketing campaigns even while their audiences were stuck at home. Yes, so as COVID-19 hit, so there have been some positive things, some negative things. So in digital marketing case, it was very good because it was being adopted by companies, small, large, any company, because it's proved to be one most effective way to conduct marketing campaigns, even while their audience was stuck at home, but they can see online, like what uh, what are the marketing, what are the products available, everything. So new digital marketing trends that kept uh, emerging, there was no stopping. Digital marketing truly helped many business survive and reestablish themselves in these testing times. So digital marketing really helped some business to survive and reestablish themselves in these times. Thus, from being a newly effective marketing component, digital marketing soon became a need for every business more than a choice. So crafting an online presence and catering to the need of the consumers was extremely vital to survive the growing competition. So this from being a newly effective marketing component, it soon became a need for every business more than a choice. So it, it not only like kept as a choice, but it's become a need. So you crafting an online presence and catering to the need was extremely vital to survive in the both competition. So with the increasing time, people spend on their phones and the internet, it was only obvious that companies had to shift their focus there. So like most of the time people use their phones to stay online. So companies have shifted attention there because if they uh, like the platforms where people are staying, if they can show their showcase their product there, they can advertise there. So people will get to know their product, people will buy their product. Hence, with the growing need for digital marketing in every company because of the benefits digital marketing offers, the scope of digital marketing has proved to be com commendable. So let's quickly look at the career growth of digital marketing now. So it, I think you understood why it became so much popular. So digital advertising industry across India had a market size of around 47 billion in 2015, which only went up to have a market size of around 199 billion in the financial year 2020. This figure is projected to go up to 539 billion rupees by the financial year 2024. So, see the graph. Previously, it was a 47 billion in 2015. So now, it only went up to market size of 199 billion. In 2020, in five years, it increased this way. The figure is projected to go up to 539 billion rupees by the financial year 2024. 
So you can see there's a massive growth in the digital, digital advertising segment. This showcases that a lot of money is being farmed into the digital channels today, which consequently means that digital marketing activities, activities are being used tremendously. To run this activity smoothly, we need highly skilled professionals to look up the fame so that one's positive statistics that indicates a motivating career scope in digital marketing in India. Another snippet from the popular job states that the current number of job openings in digital marketing in India. So this is one uh, like snippet, like what kind of job is available from Northly. You can see uh, one company, it wants digital, digital marketing. And, uh, so they should have uh, the knowledge of Google Analytics and Google Webmaster tools in communication. This is the par annum salary location, everything is there. So this kind of job, uh, job will be available. Now if you uh, search in the internet, I can show you what type of job you will get. Just a minute. And you can see these are the content writer is also one kind of digital marketing. Uh, this kind of jobs are available. Okay. Now, that's a whopping number of jobs available in digital marketing. Also, there, these are just the jobs that have been listed on Nokri. So, you can imagine the actual number of job, job opportunities which exist. Okay, so thus it is safe to say that the growth potential of careers in this field is very promising, and now is the time to get started in this field. So, you can definitely start in this field. And uh, like you don't need to be from any particular stream if you want to work here. This is one uh, plus point. So if you are still wondering like, if digital marketing is a good career option, you should certainly read this talk. Now let's continue. So who should opt for digital marketing? While thinking about digital marketing career path, it's natural that one is confused as to which career option is the right fit or which niche interests you the more. Well, the beauty of digital marketing is that it has something for everyone. So if you are someone who loves social media, then you can opt to become a social media marketing professional. Or if you are someone who is highly interested in, in coding, you can easily become a web developer. So if you uh, love social media and you can opt for social media marketing professional, otherwise if you highly interested in coding, you can go for web developer. There are a plethora of options uh, for those who want to work in a creative field. Those who have a knack for writing can select content writing also. The ones interested in designing can consider becoming graphic designer also. We discussed our career options for graphic designer. One with an analytical mind can opt to be a data analyst. Since digital marketing is a dynamic industry, one is expected to learn and be updated about the new technologies constantly.
being first sighted and curious would add a bonus to your digital marketing career. So if you think you have what it takes, then you are definitely suited for digital marketing. The digital marketing skills in demand. Now speaking of statistics, 93% of online interactions start with a search engine. This states that uh, how important it has become to make SEO friendly content so that you can rank on Google as other search engines. So fundamentally ranking your website on the top of search engine results organically and by paid means is the best form of advertising for your business. So if you uh, master skills like SEM or SEO, which increases your business ranking on search engines, that you can easily land a high paying job as it is a need of the hour, so you can fit here. Similarly, below given are a few of the most in demand digital marketing skills. View, video production marketing, paid media, content marketing, data mar analytics, search engine optimization, copywriting, pay per click, graphic designing, all these things. So, These are some options like video production, marketing, paid media, content marketing, data analytics, search engine optimization, copywriting, pay per click, and graphic designing. So as a fresher, you don't require to master all of the above skills. So learning three, four of this would give you a boost to kickstart your career. So if you would like to know more about the skills, can go to this link and you can read it. Let's now straight dive into the career opportunities in digital marketing available. So what we have discussed till now, uh, digital marketing is a like rapidly growing sector. So in from 2015 to 2024, like nine years, nine, 10 years, it has grown rapidly it has increased rapidly and the market is very good and there are different kind of jobs available so there are a lot of jobs available so if you think you're fit for the job you can do it you can easily go for it and there is not a particular stream that like if you are from art background you cannot go it's not like that you can always go so digital marketing is not only digital marketing so there is content writing, copywriting, everything. So if you love social media, you if you know how to coding, so you can go for digital marketing. Just from being a newly effective marketing content component, digital marketing soon became a need for every business more than a choice. So we have discussed it. Now, first one is digital marketing manager. So digital marketing manager strategize and implement a brand, sorry, complete digital presence. So they leverage every channel under digital marketing to promote a business product or service with the key goal of increasing their sales cost effectively. So what does the manager do? They strategize the imp and implement a brand's complete digital presence. How one brand, suppose Lakme is a brand. So how this brand will come into public in digital media, they will strategize it and they also implement that plan. They leverage every channel under digital marketing to promote a business product service with the goal of increasing their cost, uh, cost effectively. So as a digital marketing manager, one should experience more than five years and the necessary certifications to back your expertise. 
so one should have five years experience if you want to become a digital marketing manager the main responsibility as a digital marketing manager are leading the marketing team and reporting to the head or vp of digital marketing of the company so digital marketing managers are also responsible for planning and managing overall campaigns to uh, collecting different components of digital marketing to make them efficient and successful so if you are passionate about digital marketing and intend to bag a job at the mid senior managerial level like a digital marketing manager i recommend you to take check out this one so they also manage the overall campaign for like different for like advertising and you also have to lead the marketing team and report to the head or vp of digital marketing of the company so what is search engine optimizer is a very important thing search engine optimization is refers to mark making the website and web page rank on the search engine reg result anyone dealing with seo has to work on analyzing reviewing and optimizing websites using graph organic seo techniques one also needs to develop content with powerful keywords uh, for increasing website traffic so seo is a developed landscape as search engine algorithms are updated on daily basis so one needs to keep an eye out for the latest trends and news on what changes the search engines are so learn in depth seo with this online SEO course. There is SEO course also. Okay. Now, what is social media marketer? So, as the name implies, social media marketing is all about managing a company's presence in social media, including Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, LinkedIn, Pinterest, etc. social media specialist also design and execute a complete social media strategy for a company so the role for social media marketers consists of creating a social media strategy creating content according to it posting the content keeping a watch one has to con also conduct paid advertising on platforms like facebook instagram and it more leads that can eventually convert into actual customers there happens paid advertising also so one can do that so first one we discuss digital media manager uh, second is search engine optimizer that is nothing but you have to make your product in the search engine at the top social media marketer is there now content marketer is there as the role suggest content is a key part of the job So content marketing involves creating content for the online world so this can be done in the form of blog articles video email social media etc the main aim of content marketer is to create valuable content and this distributing it across re relevant channels to retain and attract an audience as a content marketer one has to work on various tasks like managing a blog create drip campaigns copywriting guest blogging and video creation email marketer email is one form of marketing that all of us have been using for ages and yet it, it still remains one of the most valuable marketing strategies statistics states that email marketing has a return on investment which makes uh, it a higher return 
than you can expect from any other form of marketing, be it digital or otherwise. So this medium is quick, accessible, and cost effective. So making it a powerful tool for business to connect with people. As an email marketer, one has to focus on building an email list, customize emails. Okay, they have to run end-to-end -end campaigns, create newsletters, update customers about new products and all. You can also build an email list and get started with uh, online email marketing course. ACM, what is ACM like ACO, search engine marketing specialist. They are also responsible for paid ads across the world, uh, search engines and display networks. So there are also video production for new uh, social media platforms. So video production and marketing have quickly become a central focus for marketing strategy. It is not a medium of entertainment to anyone, but a powerful tool for promotion and lead generation. Uh, like as a social media platforms like TikTok come up, brands have to be ready to attract consumers on these platforms. How many platforms will be there? Social media influencer can go there and advertise their product. Automation expert. So digital marketing automation is all about using software and AI to automate digital marketing activity. Now, paid media specialist is also there. The paid media specialist is responsible for, sorry. bringing in traffic to your web, web portals via online advertising. They need to be quick in identifying which platforms will be best reaching your audience. Data analyst is there and web developer is also there. Web developer is expected to be updated with the various coding languages used and have a player to create functional and attractive websites for the business. So web developer is there, data analyst is there, paid media specialist is there, automation expert is there, video production is there, ACM is there, email marketer is there, content marketer is there, social media marketer is there, search engine optimizer is there, and digital marketing manager is there. So these are all options for digital marketing. So it's really a very interesting job. If you want to go for digital marketing, uh, you can go and you can easily uh, like grab these options. Thank you all for today. We'll again meet next day.